I'm often pretty embarrassed about myself. I say things I don't really mean. I misunderstand a situation and I react in ways that I really regret afterwards. Sometimes I manage to say sorry. Sometimes it takes a while for me to realize and somehow the situation, the opportunity is gone to say I'm sorry. I do find I have that a lot with things that happened early in my life. When I was a child, when I was a young man, I said things, I did things that I now sincerely regret. We all have these things. And sometimes it is a guilt that we feel that is so encompassing that it um, takes over our whole life. We may have caused an accident. We may have said or done something that changed somebody else's life or direction in not very positive ways. And we wish we had the opportunity to make up for that, but it just cannot be redone. I believe that everybody carries things around with them that uh, really drag us down, that we are reminded sometimes every single day uh, what we have done. But if this dictates our life in a negative way, it's doing the opposite of what it could. We can learn from things. We can learn from the past. That's the beauty about being human, that we learn from something and next time we do it differently. And I'm sure that if something bothers you that you have done a long time ago, there would have been another situation where you avoided that because you have gone through that traumatic experience before. So we learn from our mistakes and that's the whole idea. We are spiritual beings in a body. And we are here to experience limitations, limitations of our mind, limitations of our behavior. But then we realize, okay, that's not what I want to experience again. And that's certainly not what I want other people to experience. So we change, we develop, we learn, we become a completely different person. And still, the memories almost, well, are, are like, like a weight around our neck. Sometimes they almost drown us. What I find interesting is when we learn Reiki, we don't need to tick boxes. We don't need to say, yes, I've been a good person. Yes, I believe in energy and in healing. No, we can be a really difficult person and a complete skeptic, and it works. So the connection that Reiki creates to higher levels of the universe can work for everybody. All we need to do is to try it out. There are no preconditions. Reiki is even used in prisons. Everybody can learn it no matter, matter what they have done. So in a way, there is a built-in forgiveness. Reiki is universal energy and indeed I'm absolutely convinced there is a built-in forgiveness in the universe. Forgiveness is the default. We are never lost. We are energy. We change. We can change and we are always connected. So we need to also forgive ourselves. And once we start doing that, we start a process of complete transformation. We become so much more open to other people and we, we really, really change. Therefore, I would like to invite you today to do a little exercise and to allow yourself to forgive your past, to accept it as past and to realize we always have the opportunity to change.
Of course, everything I suggest is somewhat connected with Reiki, which I feel incredibly helpful, but you can even do this exercise without Reiki. Just replace the word Reiki with universe or light. So when you're ready, just close your eyes and take a moment of deep honesty, going deep inside into your mind, into your memory, and especially into your feelings and sense what is bothering you that you have done in your life. It may be something very simple, very easy, not very uh, problematic, uh, just a wrong word you have said, or it may have been an accident, or it may indeed even have been a deliberate action that you now regret. Whatever it is, just remember it for a moment. Just really feel the connection and acknowledge how it still affects you. And then when you're ready, just bring your hands together and take a moment to connect to Reiki. Feel the connection. And now ask Reiki, ask the universe to help you to move on, to help you to forgive yourself. Just become aware how much you have moved on from that, how much you have changed, how much you've learned from that. And that this was an utterly human experience, but beyond that, you are, and the connection to Reiki is the proof, is spirit in a body, a spiritual being. So this was just an experience. The universe has already forgiven you. So just ask now for help to forgive yourself. And let that sink in into every fiber of your body, into your memory, into your entire awareness. Yes, I am forgiven. I have forgiven myself. And just take a moment to ask the universe to help you not to repeat that again, to really learn, change and develop. And now feel the freedom it brings. And just take a moment and thank Reiki, thank the universe for the help and slowly come back into the here and now. Forgiving yourself is the starting point for connecting and reconnecting with other people and indeed, of course, at some stage, also forgiving others. <laughs>